Hi everybody, it's Dawn from Crafting on the Green and this is card number three from the January Craft Kit. We're going to be making a lovely little card, just a nice one just to say hello to somebody with a little hidden surprise in that if you pull out the envelope it says hello all over the back. <laughs> so, and that just tucks in there. Um, yeah, so it's just a lovely little card. So I'm going to show you how to do that. First of all, from your card kit, you want to take a Whisper White card base, Pretty Peacock Matte, a Whisper White layer. And first of all, we're going to stick these all together. So I'll find my glue. So I'm going to pop the Whisper White on top of the Pretty Peacock. And then again, I'm just going to pop the peacock onto the card. There we go, just like that. That's part one done. So we'll pop that over to one side. Next, what we're going to do, um, you will need a piece of Whisper White from your card kit. Again, you should have some plenty left over from the die cuts so far. Uh, I just have a piece of scrap here. I must have scored it wrong. Um, so we're gonna stamp the large kangaroo. First of all. There we go. And we're going to stamp an envelope. Okay. Right, so now we're just going to colour these in. So I'm going to go for light crumb cake. And I'm going to use dark crumb cake as well. and covered in fluff today playing with all this glue and the cats are starting to wake up, wake up thinking it's dinner time which it's not yet do you have pets that seem to wake up and just assume it's dinner time because they're now awake I think that's what mine do <clears throat> right so I've just switched over to dark crumb cake and I'm just going to colour in the rest of the kangaroo Such a gorgeous card, this. I love using the kangaroos. And there's not too much colouring on this card either. <clears throat> not like card number two with all the presents. That had a lot of colouring. Can't forget his hand over here. There we go. And for his nose, I'm going to use light Rococo Rose. <clears throat> And for the ear, I'm going to use light petal pink. There we go. So that's him coloured. So now I'm just going to use dark cherry cobbler. <clears throat> I love dark cherry cobbler. Just to colour in the heart. And 
and you can colour it any red you want to. I think last time I used real red or maybe poppy per red, but I fancied a bit of cherry cobbler. So what I'm going to do is just cut these out um, using the die cutter. got the, the large kangaroo die and a rectangle for the envelope. Okay, I'm going to take this off here and I'm going to get the stamp that just says hello and what I'm going to do is all over the back of the envelope I'm going to put the word hello. You could put any saying you wanted to from the, the set, make sure it's the right way up. Um, Go. so lots of hellos you can try and do it a bit tidier than me as well <laughs> right so uh, what we also need is just hopping by sorry hopping by just to say hi I'm going to use that saying as well and I just need another block so I'm going to use the one that had the envelope on it and on another piece of whisper white just need to stamp that. I'm going to try and line it up in the corner because then it's easier to chop it to size. Okay, put those over there. I'm going to dig out the trimmer and first of all I'm going to Trim it about where I want it. There we go. And then just turn it to the side and I'm going to trim it again. I find it much easier trimming it to size once you've stamped it rather than trying to cut a small piece and then stamping on it. But that's just me. Right, so you'll all get in your kit as well a piece of peacock, pretty peacock cardstock. It won't quite be this size, but that's fine. You don't need much. So what we're going to do is we're going to add some glue to the back of our saying. Pop that straight on there. Leave a little bit of a border. And then we're going to run that straight through the, cut, the paper trimmer as well. So again, line it up so it's got enough of a border. It makes it so much easier than having to measure and cut. <clears throat> okay, so bring back in our card and our kangaroo and our saying. So first of all, I'm going to stick down the kangaroo, but because I want this to tuck in here, she says, in the little slot, and I don't want it to get stuck. So I'm gonna make sure that when I glue it, I'm only gonna glue from here downwards and upwards and I'm going to leave a gap in the middle just to make sure it doesn't splodge any any extra and to make sure you do it you can leave it in place so we know we want the head to be stuck down and the neck and the tail and the feet and then here I'm just going to miss out its belly right 
and I'm going to pop it somewhere over here just like that so then the card will just tuck straight in there okay next we're going to add our saying on dimensionals there now I want to stamp the butterfly but I'm going to stamp it in pretty peacock what you can do is stamp it in black and then colour it in um, but I just want it to look like it's in the background really I don't want it to be too too colourful on this one And then I'm going to take one of the Stampin' Bright basic black markers and I'm just going to add, I call them flight lines, I don't really know what else they're known as, but I'm just going to add some so that it looks like he's having a, a fun old time flying around. There we go, just like that. And you can go wherever you want to with it. On this one, I came down the side. Um, you know, have a bit of fun. You could have it all over the card if you wish. <laughs> uh, right, and then finally, I'm going to use the Ivory Stampin' Blend just to give it a bit of shadow. Underneath him. And there we go. If you'd like to on the inside of the card, you can again um, stamp another cute little butterfly. And you can do that on any of the cards. But again, just using the, the stamping right marker. Lots of little lines. There we go. And there we go. That is card number three from the January craft kit. So I hope you enjoyed making this one. Um, I love the little surprise on the card. And yeah, um, I will see you for card number four very shortly. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.